Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? Who will be the- Bigby? Miss White! <gasps> what the fuck? Excuse me, I... yeah. What's she doing? I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. The spell's, the spell's broken, she can! What's she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. Say it! We're kind of in the middle of something. Bluebeard. She has something to say, and we're gonna listen. The spell is Go broken, right she can say it. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut you... up. Yeah! You enslaved us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. But you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I Nerissa! My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just... He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily... That's a lie! I was in the goddamn room when he did it! Faith and Lily yes! were dead because of you! The only two people who ever gave a damn about me! Don't worry. He's gonna pay for it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say-so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty! Good enough for me? Me too. So, that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves! You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. What did you expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. Well done, then. Damn now, right. for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. I'll we do it. We imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I not good you. enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't hasn't stopped. Been enough I don't care. So we get rid of him. So we here. can send him Everyone, away. Everyone, listen up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we... This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. We should yourself. vote. We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think Democracy! that's going to work? <laughs> He's right. It's gonna be a Nobody tie. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. You Fine. fuckers. Are you sure? This isn't how it's- It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay. Mr. Wolf, it's your call. Snow. Just do what you think is right. Yes, Sheriff. Do Rip his think? head off? Teach him a fucking lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. Just fucking get rid of him. Not this way. Oh, fuck! I didn't... No! I didn't... No, 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 no! I didn't... Oh, I was deciding! I was deciding! You motherfucker! Now you're gonna die! There you are. I hope you all... Remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. Fuck you. you. Know, just between us, I was gonna let you live. But now, you're going to miss me. No. I won't. Ah, I'm ripping your fucking head off. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah! Fuck 
you, crooked man. I fucked him right in the pussy. <laughs> Snow is gonna. And faith. They're so scared of me. Yes, another one of us to erase from the books. Snow hates me. No, I'm never gonna get in her panties. I couldn't help myself. That's it? That's the it? Oh, we're in the apartments. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <sighs> I think I've lost count. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay, great. What the fuck? This fucking line. Dude's fucking... Oh, what's up, man? Look at all these fables. They're all headed to the farm? Why is... Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, Flycatcher left his keys. Ah. Listen, Snow, uh, can we talk? I, I wanted to... I'm, I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. I fucked we'll up, talk guys. Later, okay? I fucked up, guys. I didn't get the girl. <laughs> it looks like Lane is a frog. It did. <laughs> You're late. Oh my god. I didn't get the girl. But you know what? Someone's oh, gonna my boy. see you, Colin. Aww. He's headed to the farm. I hope he's not headed for the farm, actually. I don't know what he's doing. Come on, there's gotta be a happy ending. Give me a good ending. I deserve it, right? Probably not. I ripped a dude's head off. I killed a lot of people. <laughs> in five episodes. Oh, no. Colin! Jesus! They have to go to the farm. I feel so bad. We only have, like, five minutes. And carry me for fuck's sake. I don't give a shit. You forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. Nice fucking day. Oh, shit. Just go grab that, would you? Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me I'll get another chance, but Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. Wait, Sheriff Bigby, I have something. <laughs> you know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye, so if you could bring it to her, she was nice. Yeah, sure. I couldn't take them all with me, and she said she liked that one the best. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, because when they're little, they oh, have these man. pouches that squirt juice at you if you touch them. That's weird. I'm sure she'll love it. She said it was pretty. We're about ready to head out. Good What's little TJ. Like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. Don't worry. You'll be a lot safer there. There's plenty of space to run around, uh, and a nice river nearby so you can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Yeah. You don't have to worry about the Monday seeing you. It'll be nice. <laughs> Come on, it won't be so bad. No, TJ, don't cry. Have you been there before? No, I'm uh, 
Some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. So you wouldn't know, would you? We're all set. Bye, Mr. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Hey, Big B. Whoops out a sig. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? How should I know? Damn. Oops. My boy Colin's staying upstairs with me. Saying goodbye? Maybe I will get a girl after all. Or is she going to the farm too? Hi. Hi. You're still wearing that thing. Oh. Yeah. I guess I am. It's not easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to. It's just... Let me help. Bigby, I... I know oh, you're shit. trying to help. But this is just something I need Oops. to do on my own. Okay? Okay. Listen, Whatever head I, fell off. I came here because Headfish. I have to tell you something. Oh no. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. I'm not sure where to start. What now? <sighs> Faith... Lily and I, we had this plan. We we're gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I... I had no choice. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the lengths they'd go just to silence someone who had physical evidence? Marissa, what did you do? I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. You were just trying to protect them. Yeah. Georgie promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. But then... Oh, God. <laughs> she wants the dick. But she's about to tell me something happened. fucked up. But that night danger, at the club, Skyler. Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there, as he was telling me this, Faith walked in, and I had to watch while Georgie... Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man? Back at the well, you said... I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. I guess... Uh, she fucking lied? I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't gonna let him get away with it because of a stupid technicality. Especially after... That night, after Faith. I tried to warn Lily, but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I... I left Faith's head at your doorstep. You? I walked her over here, and I left her. Just hoping that maybe if I couldn't save them, could at least save the rest of us. You were trying to get my attention. So you... You started all this. I just pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The You're crooked man was killing bitch. on them. When we suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes it that way. We just fade like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith or Lily. Nobody cares about us. It's going to be different now, I promise. Things like that won't happen anymore. Not while I'm around. You'll make things right. You and Snow. I don't know. It seems like no matter what I do, it's just not enough for her. Or anyone. I just can't win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but 
They need you, Bigby. Both of you. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other, and look out for us. You don't see that a lot these days. Snow doesn't really need me. I'm sure that's not true. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You protected your friends, no matter the cost. And you brought justice to this town, finally. Because you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. You've been given this job for a reason. And I left Faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, it was you. I've been making well, a lot of she, mistakes. Well, she, don't make me with. blush. But you've also done a lot of good. Don't forget that. You've changed this place. For better or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. Aw, oh, shucks. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Dun dun dun. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we've met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. What hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom? They used to call me the little mermaid. Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. Go after her. I'll see you around. Wolf. Wait, what? What? I'm so fucking confused. What did you do to Georgie? You and 43.5% of players killed Georgie. I'm in the minority? I know. Well, I understand it's faith, but what the fuck? What the fuck? I realize it's faith, but... That's what the fuck. Did you give the crooked man a trial? You and 70.8% of players brought the crooked man back alive interesting how did you punish the crooked man you and 21.1 percent of players ripped the crooked man's head off did you accept tj's gift for snow you and 94 percent are night there's people who didn't accept the gift that's so fucked up jesus and what were your last words to narissa i've made a lot of mistakes you and 28.6 percent of players Man. Special stats. Beast, you lied to him about seeing Beauty outside the apartment. Beauty, you promised her you wouldn't tell Beast that you saw her outside the apartment. I got you back, Beauty. Colin, you gave him a drink when he asked for one in your apartment. You help him you help him to avoid the farm. Crooked man, deceased. You took him back to the witching well, you ripped his head off. D, you chose to burn him with a cigar during the interrogation. You confiscated D's money while he was in custody. And you killed dumb. Faith, you gave her money after the fight with the woodsman. Deceased. Georgie, you smashed up you smashed up his place, you took money from Georgie's safe. Deceased. Greenleaf, you burned her tree. Gren, you ripped his arm off at the trip trap bar. You drank with Gren after Lily's funeral. Holly, you pretended to be a woodsman while she was passed out. Oh, that's right, I did. You made a deal with him, Jack. Narissa, you tried to take her ribbon off in Bigby's office. You tried to take her ribbon off during your final conversation. <laughs> I just always fucking tried to take her ribbon off. You brought her along with you to the trip trap. You promised to bring the crooked, ba crooked man back alive, which I did both. Boom. Tiny Tim, you chose to wait for him. TJ, you accepted his beetle and promised to give it to Snow, and you slapped him during the interrogation in his apartment. You stood up for him when Snow wanted to send him to the farm. The special stats. Oh my god. Oh 
Oh, it was Nerissa the whole time. Right, 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 right. I see what you mean. He never even met Faith. Oh, that's what you... Oh, my God. Now it makes sense. Just so he would care. Oh, my... Okay. And he pieced it together right there at the end because of what she said. Ah... Yeah, I didn't get I didn't even get a woman. At the end of that season one, I didn't even get a woman. It's just bullshit. I didn't fuck up. Well yeah, I didn't I didn't get a woman, so I, I kinda fucked up. But that's the end of season one of The Wolf Among Us. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um Delicious Fish says the farm is only for animals who can't blend into the human world in case you didn't know. Well, I, I know, I realize that. They don't have glamour. Uh Max Your Face and Maxi Poo says, You're rad. You're rad. Thank you guys. Um but thank you guys so much for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to give it a like. And uh, hopefully you guys want to uh, subscribe for all future videos. And if you're watching this on Twitch, um, hit that follow button. We're just going to let the credits roll. What would you guys think about that episode? That was pretty... A lot of dialogue, obviously, because it was it was kind of concluding. Now I, I kind of... Now that the, the entire series is over, now I want to go back and play through it again differently. So, uh, not right now, but eventually, maybe one day we'll just do a huge stream um, and we'll just play through the entire game and, and do completely, you know, everything completely different. Trill Kelvin, thank you for subscribing, you're welcome. Um, so, it was pretty cool, the plot twist, I didn't expect that at the end. Um, the Crooked Man, I don't know. What, what happens if you allow the Crooked Man to live? You know, that's the question. Also, if you want to check out my Facebook or my Twitter, sound below, I'm gonna dance!